Oh, what up? Welcome to our first ever episode of Stone All Petite. I'm your host, Toby. They call me Toad's Boat. Uh, I don't know why, but uh, let's get started. So this recipe comes from my buddy Jerry, J-Bones, what up? And basically all it is is ramen noodles, romaine, depends on where you're from. And you take Doritos, nacho cheese style, and you crumble them up and you put them on top. He says it's really good. Uh, I mean, I trust the dude. He's a real good guy. He crashed at my place for like two weeks and he's just a good dude. So the first thing you guys are going to want to do is you're going to want to make your noodles. Most of you guys watching are familiar with these noodles, so you already know how to do it. Basically, you just boil water and you just put the noodles in and you just wait for them to get soggy and delicious. He said he only usually uses the chicken kind. Um, I only eat the roasted chicken kind. Any friend that tries to feed you the non-roasted chicken kind and the regular chicken kind is not your real friend. I got the chili kind, so we're going to see how delicious this is. You just put that in there. Oh, man, that almost got me. You got to be careful, though. For real. That hot water almost burned my hand, dude. Can't have that happening. Oh man, I almost forgot the most important part. Do not, I repeat, do not use tap water while making anything, dude. For real. People always say, oh yeah, the hot heat is going to take out all the shit that they got in that water. No, dude, that's just the stuff that the government has put in their head, dude. Fluoride and chlorine and shit's all up in that water. No, dude. I use bottled water. I use the gallon of water. Don't ever use tap water, dude. Don't listen to them, dude. They just want you to have fluoride in your mind, in your system, so it forgets all your memories, dude. I honestly like to have my memories, dude. I like to know what's going on. Like, where's that little pack? Where'd that little pack go? Shit, bro, where's the pack? So, like, after a couple minutes of letting them boil and, like, get mushy and shit, then it's time to stir, and then you add your little packet, dude. So, you want to take it, and you want to sprinkle it all around so each noodle gets that powder on it, dude, so it gets tasty. But you got to be careful, because that... That heat, man, it will get you. You gotta be safe. That's the most important thing. I don't want no third degree burns on my hands, dude, because this hot water from these noodles got me, dude. That'd be a crazy story to tell of the bros, though. <laughs> then you're gonna wanna reduce the heat. You're gonna turn that flame off. It's gone by flame. Thanks for what you did for me, dude, with my noodles. Then you're gonna let them noodles sit and soak up that powder water and absorb all that flavor, dude, and become a delicious, man. I'm pumped. So while we're letting them noodles soak up that delicious flavor, I'm gonna go talk to my friend Bob Doobie real quick, and I'll be like right back, okay? Oh, no way, who made noodles? Oh, oh, what's up? My name's Toby, they call me Tubbs Bo, but What's that? We already did this. Oh, man. Oh, who made noodles? So now all we gotta do is get a bowl, put them in there, then put the Doritos on top and try it out. See how good old Chef Jerry's all about his tastiness, you know? <laughs> oh, dude, no way. My hot pocket, dude, I was looking for this. I put it, I must have thought this was the microwave. Dude, seriously, I thought someone stole this thing, man. I even called the cops, dude. They thought I was joking. I wasn't joking, man. Someone came in and took my Hot Pocket, bruh. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, look at them. Do you hear that sound? That sound? Dude, that's how you know they're so juicy and moist and just full of flavor. Oh, man. <laughs> Crunch them up a little bit, dude. Just put them on top, bro. Get them all sprinkled in there, man. Oh, shit. Now it's my favorite part. Well, we try it. But first, you gotta put a little bit of salt. You gotta always put a little bit of pepper on it, too. That's good. All right. Let's see if we're gonna hit it and spit it, or if we're gonna hit it and get it. It's 
It's kind of like your own little mini casserole, if you think about it. All right, that's for this episode of Stone Appetit. That was good. If you have any ideas and things you like to eat when you're high, send them my way, and we'll make them, and we'll share with all of our friends here, and we'll make them and eat them, and tell each other about them, dude. Send them my way. Thanks for watching. Later, dudes. And girls, too, dude. Not just dudes, girls, also. I don't know.